Hi, and welcome to the affiliate marketing series of uh, our tutorial videos here. Uh, what I want to show you first here is Commission Junction. And uh, before I go into my account, I'm going to show you the sign-up page where you would sign up. Uh, you simply go in here and you have a published application. You select your language. I've selected English. Select your country and the dollar uh, currency that you use. And then you just simply click Next. It then brings you to this page for Publisher Application Step 2. And you have a service agreement to read here. And we'll scroll down. You read the service agreement. And it's quite long. And just click I read. And, and click the privacy policy. I'm at least 18 years of age. And go down here to site information, website or newsletter name. I'm going to use one of my other websites here. And cool websites.com. Uh, my site. Bluetooth headsets. Category, I'm going to select. I'm going to go down here and find the right category for my particular product. And uh, look at computers electronics. Scroll down here and see you know, telecommunications. And that's what I'm looking for is telecommunications. So I'm going to go to telecommunications and promotional methods, website content, search engine marketing, email marketing. I use a little bit of everything. No incentives. And I'm going to enter contact information. So you'd enter in your name and information here, phone number email address, verify email, and uh, if you're doing it under a company, you would put your organization name. If not, you just put your name here. Address, your city, state, zip code, and then your tax ID, whether it's uh, your own social security number or your business ID, and then you select how you want to receive your commission. So what you do here is click either check or direct deposit. And then you put the characters in the box and click accept terms. And it will send you a verification email so that you can log into your account and get started. Now since I already have an account set up, we're going to go ahead and use my account so I can show you many of the products that you can sell through Commission Junction. When you first log in, it's going to bring you to this page that shows you home, account, get links, run reports, etc. And it will show you... Uh, some things here. Um, I haven't promoted anything so far this month on CJ um, in this particular account. So uh, you see it shows commission is zero. And uh, we're going to show you some uh, new advertisers here. You scroll down and it shows you some of the new advertisers that have just signed up with Commission Junction. And here they'll have pending offers that you may want to check out, which I'll check those out later. And to find products to sell, you just go over here and click on Get Links. And since I'm looking for telecommunications stuff, I'm going to click down here and just click on Telecommunications. And it gives me a list of telecommunications companies here that I could sell for. So uh, I can click on this one, phone power, um, let's see, Globe Talk, Jamster, and I'll click on this too, just to show you how it works. And then you just simply scroll down and click on Apply to Program. And the screen pops up, and uh, you'll see something like this. Uh, this one, apply, the uh, advertiser approves publishers manually. 
uh, via talk, the application has been approved, and then Jamster and Globe Talk also approved manually. So they'll uh, set it to a pending application until the advertiser actually approves it. So I'm going to close that. And I'm back over here, and I want to go into via talk, the one that automatically approved me. And I'm going to go just click on view links. And you can see there are quite a number of different types of links that you can use. And uh, you have a text link here that has been doing fairly well. This shows you the earnings per click uh, for three months and seven days. And uh, you can check these all out. If you want to use a banner, you can use a banner. So, for example, if I wanted to use this banner here, I could just go over here and click on Get HTML. And what this does is it allows you to choose a website. And uh, for tracking purposes, you want to make sure that website is actually added to your account. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back into my admin area and set that up. So I'm going to show you that in just a second. Okay, I'm in the admin area. And uh, you just go into Website Settings. And I'm going to click on Add a New Website. And it brings this little pop-up screen here. And of course, I'm going to put cool headsets in here. And the URL is coolheadsets.com. And I'm going to put we sell Bluetooth headsets. And you can select your primary category, which, once again, it's going to be telecommunications. So I'm going to scroll down and find that. And click Save. Okay, we're back here. And what I want to do is I'm going to choose my uh, Cool Headsets website. So I'm going to scroll down here and find that. Now I want to encrypt the link. And I want to open in a new window. And if you like, you can also hide a tracking code in the link. I'm not going to do that for this. I'm just going to keep it simple. And then you have your code right here that you would simply copy and paste into your website. So I'm going to highlight that and copy it. And I'm going to show you how to put this into your site. Now, I don't actually have the cool headset site set up yet, so what I'm going to do is just use it on my California cell phone live site. And uh, I'm going to show you the way I do it. You can actually use widgets or however you want, but what I do is I make my templates where I can edit them. And you do that simply by changing your permissions with your FTP client or in your cPanel. And uh, I'm going to go over here to uh, my theme. And I'm going to edit the theme. And what I want is my main template here. Actually, what I'm going to do is put this in my sidebar instead. So I'm going to go in here, and I already have something for Technorati, and I'm just going to take that out. And I'm going to just highlight this, and I'm going to paste that new one in here. And click Update File. And we look over here on my site, and here's the ad right there in my sidebar. That simple. Next, we're going to look at ClickBank. OK, and here we are at ClickBank. And uh, I'm going to show you the sign-up process here. Just click on Sign Up. And it brings us this screen. And I'm going to put in... Uh, your city in here, anywhere, um, put your state, and you want to put in your name, of course it would be the same or whatever, email address, um, I'll just use a sample like they gave here, phone number, put your phone number in there. 
address of your website, if you have one, put an account nickname, and if you want to receive promotions or information from ClickBank, you click that. And this will actually be your ID for your account. So, for example, if you were going to use uh, my uh, CB account, whatever, you put whatever you want to put in there, um, five to ten letters. And then all you do here is click on Submit, and what they're going to do is send you a uh, confirmation and a link for you to actually sign into your account. Now, since I already have an account set up, I'm going to go ahead and log into my account just to show you how ClickBank works. So I'm going to go up here and go to My Account. Now, this is an account that I just set up for purposes of this video, so it doesn't show any sales whatsoever in here. And uh, what I want to do is show you the Marketplace area. You get in the marketplace, it gives you the ability to search by categories or keywords. And uh, you know, let's say that we want to look for cell phone stuff again. I can just put that in there and click Go. And it brings me quite a few choices here. Reverse phone detective, public records flow, reverse mobile, some different things there. And uh, you look over here and uh, it shows you some statistics here. Average per sale, 16.24. Percentage of sale commission at 75%. Referred, that's 96% referred. Uh, it means mostly affiliate selling. And the gravity, the higher the gravity, the better. So this is a really high gravity product. So uh, let's check that out. You can uh, view the pitch page here. And here we see the reverse phone detective pitch page. Find out the owner of any cell phone or unlisted number. So you can put it in here and it will tell you uh, the carrier and name and address and everything right here so that's pretty cool um, now let's take a look and see how we actually create a hop link for this product and we're back over here on that page uh, it shows us the products and all you do is to simply click on create a hop link so we're going to click that and it brings us this pop-up page and you put in your clickbank id name and i'm just going to click one of these other ones that I have. Tracking ID, you can put in anything you want there. I'll put cool headsets. Cool head, that's good enough. Create. And you see it brings me up the link that I would need to actually use to uh, send people to. Now what you want to do is you want to actually cloak this and that's uh, something we'll have to go into in another video but this would be your link to sell that particular product and it's just that easy to set up things to sell on uh, ClickBank. So now we're going to go into uh, pay.com and I'm just going to keep that one quite simple for you and uh, make it a little short since this video is getting kind of lengthy uh, but we'll go to pay.com next. Okay, Here we are at pay.com and uh, this is a site that's owned by Mike Vilsame. And uh, I already have an account, but I'm just going to show you the sign-up area here. As you see, most of these are pretty much similar. You just choose your email, a username, your password, and confirm your password. You'll enter in your name or business name. Make checks payable to whoever, uh, your address. and Social Security or ID and the PayPal email is pay.com uses PayPal so you want to put in your PayPal email address there and uh, if you want to pay your affiliates with any of the following methods I understand by choosing less options I may get less affiliates um, I use just pay mine through PayPal so you can click either one but I would stick with PayPal and the same thing here uh, affiliates if you, you want to be paid by PayPal or check and then you agree to the terms and conditions. Enter in the CAPTCHA. And then click Start Making Money Today with Pay.com. And uh, it's, that's, it's that, that's it. that simple to set it all up. So um, what I want to do is go back here and just log into my account. 
Now I'm logged into my account, and uh, I actually have a couple of different Pay.com accounts. Um, this particular one I haven't done uh, anything with here lately, but I uh, just wanted to show you some of the things here. You know, you can look in here, my sales, my products, manage affiliates, promote products. And for this video, I just want to show you about promoting products. So we'll look at uh, promoting products here and uh, promote products as an affiliate. And when you see this come up, this is actually my product at the very top of the page. Um, you have uh, LCM landing page, article underground, blogger's guide, to profits. Um, and if I click on promoting products from marketplace, any subcategories to choose from, just like uh, CJ and uh, ClickBank. So you can go in here and uh, uh, just for giggles, let's just do computing and internet. And we can go down here and we see uh, iPhone unlock software. That would go along with one of my cell phone sites. So let's check that one. I'm going to click on promote. And you see here it brings you this page to promote it. And you can get the link here. This vendor hasn't provided anything like telefriend or email letters or anything like that. And no banners. Let's see. They're not showing up. Well, that's all there is to it. I mean, you just go in here and play around with it and, and uh, look for products that you want. And uh, you would simply copy and paste the code into your site just like I showed you how to do with the uh, Commission Junction link. Okay, now what we're going to do in another video is we're going to show you how to do some pre-selling and things like that. But uh, for this series, we'll go ahead and stop now um, since the video is getting kind of lengthy. And uh, we'll see you on the next video.